Hello, this is Andrew Ford. We're going to take footage that we shot in Log using a color checker. We're going to bring it into DaVinci Resolve and use the color checker to gain accurate color. So in Resolve, we create a new timeline with the selected clip. If you click on the eyedropper, you'll choose color chart and you'll see the color chart pattern appear in the window. Now many people will shoot talent holding the color checker so you'll have a close-up shot. I want to show you that it's possible just to have the color checker anywhere in your shot because you can scale and move this color checker image and as long as each of these outline boxes are in the boxes of the color checker in your video, you'll be fine. And then we will zoom in for some fine tuning and we just want to make sure that every outline square is in its representative color. Once that's the case, we will click on the color match button below and you'll see that we have a drop down menu of various color checkers and we will select the one that we used. In this case, it was the data color spider checker 24. The color palette will update and we'll be able to pick the source gamma. I shot this on my Sony FS7 and I know that I use Sony Log 3 or S Log 3. Our target gamma is fine and the color temp in this instance is fine. And then we select the match button and immediately you can see the color change in the window. The various color palettes on the color match area show a percentage and that's the percentage that you know we were off or the percentage that the colors were altered. As you can see, we we're pretty close in some colors, but not perfect. And now we are in a much better place. And from here, you can use the scopes in Resolve to fine tune your color correction. You'll notice that your log footage has far superior gradation and you are now free to continue your editing with footage that is of a more accurate color.